And now, on with the show. Hello and welcome back to the show featuring the Long Dark with the Faithful Cartographer update. So I've been busy. Not super busy. Maybe a couple of days have passed. I've been well somewhat busy making the wolf skin coat, but now I'm screwed because I have cabin fever. I want to finish the coat. That's sort of the priority at this point, so I'll probably stick around at least long enough to do that. What I want to do with my time is... That's the question, isn't it? So, I mean, the food I got, I could probably head out of here and try to make my way at least to the, the lookout. Maybe sleep out on the shelter, but that still means I have to deal with wolves and other bullshit on the way there, which is all right. Um, that's, that's something I can deal with. But let's see where I am as far as supplies are concerned. Food is a priority. I got plenty of that. Denied. The weather is turning a bit on the shitty side, so that's not a good thing. But I do want to finish the coat. The coat's really not that far away at all. I think I have maybe, as you can see, there's only two, there's only one pelt and one cured gut left, so maybe a few hours, maybe two hours to go. I, I should just push it. I really should, and then deal with the cabin fever, but I don't. And that means having to sleep in here another day. I don't know if sleeping eight hours in here will lead to whether it'll wake me up. You know what? Let's just try that. I don't give a damn. Oh, let me also make sure I got the lamp on me. That's the cool thing. It, the, the weather may turn to shit. It's sounding like it will. But I'm not going to just run out as soon as I get cabin fever. I may be able to accomplish something here. I have four and a half hours to go. And I believe I'm going to lose sunlight in about three hours. Let's do two hours and see how our cabin fever is doing. I don't care if I can't sleep. That I can live with. I oh, sorry too. Yeesh, I may not make it. I may not make it. I may not make it. Uh, I made it. Two and a half hours to go. Check cabin fever. 50%. That's a severe increase. Now what I could do is just sleep outside. I could run to the car real quick. Sleep outside and that'll reduce my cabin fever for now. Ooh, I'm thirsty. But the risk is I'll have to jump out there with the plethora of wolves that could be in the area. Plus, that's the killer car. That's a soul-sucking car out there. So, do I want to do that? Am I willing to take that kind of chance? Is it worth it? These are questions that I must ask myself. Because in the morning, it's going to be freaking cold as hell out there. Do I want to be out there in the cold? So anyways, let's uh, let's put this lamp down here. Because if there's wolves out there, oh, come over here. If there's wolves out there, my best bet is simply to have a torch out and use that as the the thing that keeps them at bay. But it's a matter of having a torch, isn't it? And a good one for that matter. And I don't seem to have any good ones, thankfully. I think I still have some in here. Oh, look at me failing. Nope, I took the last of the torches out. I don't have any on me. That's, that's, uh, that's not, oh yes I do, I have one on me. Okay, so I have one crappy torch on me. I don't think I have any good ones. So that's the end of that, and I can't really, I can make one I guess. But I just need one, I need enough to just get me to the car. It's fucking windy as hell out there, though. Yeah, it is really decision time, isn't it? So what we're gonna do here... It's dark as hell. I have enough water, I believe. Let's make sure. 16, that should be enough for the morning time. 
the door. Oof. Alright. Alright, let's see what's out here. Probably a dog fight right away. The car of death, as it is known in these parts. Many a survivor has died in this car. Hmm. Feels like 47. That's comfortable. That's rather comfortable. Also, this, the area seems to be devoid of wolves at this time. Should wait a little bit and listen to some howls. Listen to see if I can hear some howls. But I think we're good. I think it's all right. I have enough here. I think I have enough to survive the night at least. And if I don't, let's see some peanut butter. Oh, did I get painkillers? Well, at least I didn't. A lot of strange noises out there. And my inability for my neck to turn any further is distraught. Distra <laughs> distressing. I was gonna say distraughting. Not even a word. Well, I'm just gonna make a word up. Distraughting. It's very distraughting. There we go. We got it. Making a t shirt out of that one. Yeah, there's not much to do though, so it's about time I shut up. Oh, can I do a... Oh, I'm gonna survey the area in the dark. Awesome. Awesome. Oh. Well, this is the vehicle that I'm in. That's funny that it doesn't map anything else. Am I doing the shuffle luffle of... rolls? I think I do. Yeah, there they are. There's two of them over there. If you see where my dot is out there crossing... Oh, look at this guy. Crossing right in front of the car. See, they're so freaking stealthy. But they all seem to be leaving the town, which is... I'm okay with that. I'm good with that. But yeah, I got lucky by jumping out through the front door instead of the back. That would have been an interesting encounter in the dark. And I'm pretty much done with greater encounters in the dark. Tell you what. So yeah, they're all heading out. And being smug. And I need to stop wasting time. You just don't want to be here in the dark, passing time and freezing my ass off. So, well, I already ate, so I might as well drink and then at least top off a little bit here. Alright, let's get some rest. Oh, I drank that much? Oh, I drank four, okay. So, the. I guess some, one of these assholes is making his way back. Oh, I'm sleeping an hour. Not what I wanted to do, but I guess I'm doing it. Forty-four days. And yeah, the weather's actually gotten darker and harder to see. So anyways, I didn't want to sleep an hour, that's dumb. It's uh Huh. I'm concerned that if I sleep too long I may wake up with hyperthermia. But I think the game just I think the game now wakes you up, so you don't end up sleeping dead. Uh, if you get hyperthermia because I got it before. I got it during test. I was sleeping in a cave and I got too cold and it woke me up. So you no longer have to... You know, you no longer sleep through your death of cold. Mm. But 
Fuck if I'm taking that chance. So it'll take four hours. See how things are going. Oh, the moonlight came out. Look at that. A beautiful night to go for a night hike. If I only had a machine gun or a flamethrower. It's fairly quiet. 32. It's not bringing it down that much. Yeah, I should have slept the full night. But I'm gonna have to head back in there and finish the coat in the morning anyways. Let's do five hours and my condition's back up. My sleep meter is not. And let's do that. It'll be early morning, I believe. Yeah, it's dawn. And there's a giant bear over there, standing still. Oh, now he decided to walk. The good thing is that... Oh, let's see where we're at. 5%, that's not bad. I don't want to shoot him. I'm really, I, I really need to take more patience with the, with the, oh, okay, with the bear. Good, I'm doing the walking man. Ooh, I'm walking in pace. I'm, I'm heading out. I'm heading back in. It's early enough. Go! What was wrong with you? So that'll kick up. This is gonna kick up my cabin fever up some. But today is a day I'm making this coat. And I believe I may be leaving this town. Or this, uh, yeah, not that this town, but the. The actual area. How much time I got? He's only got. Like I got two and a half hours to go. Yeah, I can do this easily. It's gonna just kick up my cabin fever up something fierce. But we're gonna get the whole thing done though. Yeah. Oh. oh, look at that, I got no afflictions. But it's, yeah, I think the way the counter goes, I wasn't, I didn't spend enough time outdoors for it not to kick in right away. I don't know when cabin fever went away. I wasn't looking. Oh, that's where I use the knife for this stuff. So what am I doing? <laughs> I'm, I'm not looking at what I'm supposed to be wearing. So look, let's take a look. It's heavy. It's got nice, nice protection here. Nice, uh, nice protection. Nice, uh, it's nicely waterproof. It's warm and it has good windshield protection and it's 50% when it comes to, when it comes to shielding, it's toughness, but it is freaking heavy and it does slow you down. Let's compare it to the Parka. Slow down by seven, not as water resistant, not as warm, not as heavy, but also not as tough. Same thing with this stupid thing. Not as heavy, definitely not as heavy. Good wind, decent wind protection, decent water, shield and I don't know what I call it, waterproofness but it's not the toughest thing you'll ever encounter this one's 5, this one's 15 we're talking 20, we're talking 30 which would be the one reason to keep it 
Not that it rains that much. But also because we don't want to double up. I mean, this thing's twice this, this one. It is also... Not twice as strong, but 1.5 is strong. This one's fairly weak. So... So yeah, I mean... There is uh, I could literally we just wear the the skin coat the wolf coat and just dump the rest. I don't really need these two. The shielding is not that good, the waterproofness is not that good, the warmth is not that good. I tell you that. Okay, I'll have to take a look at my entire paper doll here and see. Where are we at? One proof bonus, etc., etc., etc. So I got a, I'm at 11 right now. One corner is 32. Let's just take these off. That goes to 9 and 25. Let's put this on. Hmm. Look at that. Protection is 30%. Sprint 71. Let's take it off. And let's put this on again. I know, I know I'm probably becoming very annoying right now. Okay, this dude just cut it out. Sprint 77, 18, 32, 11, 18. I'll go back. Oh, so I got a better sprint. Production similar. Yeah, everything's fairly similar. So I haven't found the mother of boots, which are kind of the way to go. I don't know. If I put this on, Sprint goes down to 79. Sprint group bonus is plus 11. More bonus is a little bit higher. Protection is 18, 30. Uh, you know what? Just about fuck those things. That's what I'm thinking. We're good. Come over here. I don't know why I dropped them. They're going in the closet. That's what I'm saying. I really don't have anything else I could wear. Plaid shirt, yeah. Nah, nah. That's heavy as hell. Ragged sweatshirt. I don't even know where this goes. It's a good, it's kind of good on its own. That's what I'm thinking. That's my take on it. I haven't really, I have to admit, I haven't really played with clothes that much. As, well, as much as I'm doing right now, which is probably no, not the most exciting thing ever. Yeah, yeah. But I think we're good. I think the main thing to do right now, more than anything else, as of today, is to complete my mission. My mission is to go and... I don't know if that freaking bear is going to be out there, though. That freaking bear could be right out there right now as we speak. So the best bet is probably going out through the back. I think? I can't be sure. Because <laughs> enough time has passed that he could be out there right now. could be out front for all I know. The best thing about it is that he's pushing all the wolves out of the way. And pushing, if there are any wolves out there to begin with. What? Alright. Well, Rick, you gotta get your shit together here, buddy. You gotta make a decision. Either you're searching... Either you're searching those three cabins, which you wanna do, so let's just do that. Hmm. Six bullets. Or you're not. In which case, you should just head out to Mystery Lake and do what you were originally thinking about doing. Yeah, not on load. Ain't like nothing's bad gonna happen. Well, I'm trying to clean it. Oof. That sound just scared the shit out of me. I thought for sure I was gonna, that weapon was gonna discharge right to my face. As it should, for me trying to clean it while it's loaded. 
But you know, the game can't account for everything, right? Even something as simple as the weapon discharging and firing off in your face. Can't they can't take they can't take advantage. I can't really figure that shit out. Come over here. Come over here. I want you right now. No, in a sexual way. And I want some of you. Let's take two. Yeah, let's take two and transform. Yeah, so that's the last of it for you, buddy. One, two, three. One, two, three. And let's make some torches. Yeah, I'm using the non existent hammer. And let's make another one. And let's put it back if I have any left. I got some left. Put it back. I got three torches. I'll live with that. Okay, now what I have to live with is. Mm, what I have to live with now is whether or not. Do I really want to go out the front? Because that's a kind of a dumb way to go, is what I'm thinking. But considering where I'm going, it might not be such a bad thing. All right, here we go. I may need to turn around quickly, so I'm ready and getting ready for that. Oh, there's something walking around out there. I don't know if it's a bear or a wolf. Sounds like a... Sounds like a wolf. Problem is the wolves do sort of come out very quickly out of the side of the freaking garage. I'm not running up there. That that guardrail is killer. A guard will get you killed more than anything else. Woo! Huh. Well, there's at least two of these assholes here. So the bear is obviously gone. Am I really that thirsty? Because I did not pick any more water up! <laughs> see, this is how you end up getting stuck in your own freaking house. Can't see the goddamn walls. There he is, he's turning around. Okay, that's good. Where's the one over here? The one in front of me. Where is he at? Oh, there it is. There he is. Oh, yes. This is what I like. Why did? Why can't I see him on my uh, on my right over here? He turned around. He should have been walking down this road down here. I guess I'm about to see whether or not they disappear in, uh, in foul weather, which I'm, I'm starting to suspect they don't. Well, that was a short little jaunt. But hey, I'm definitely not gonna take a walk on the shitty weather side. That's just dumb. I'd rather get cabin fever. Hey, do I have... Oh no, these are mine right here. I'm dressing it. I was thinking for a second that they were in here in the locker. Let's hydrate. Alright, well look, it's shitty weather. Let's try to do something with that shitty weather. What can we do? Make arrows would be kind of a good thing. 
I think I need four of these. And I don't know if I actually have four. I've killed two deer and butchered one, so that's why I only have three. And that's why I think I can make I can make the boots, but I can't make the pants. That's correct. Also stylish. So that'll take 20 hours. I don't really have 20 hours at this point. I have maybe eight hours, I believe, maybe six. Six to eight hours. So what can I do with this time? Hmm, I could sing. I could recite poetry. I can't read because damn are there not very many books around here. There are no books in in the coastal highway. I could make another bow. Not necessary. Can make a shitload of arrows. You know what? Let's do that because that'll give me. I think it does give me. It actually gives me points on my arrow skill, I believe. See, every time you make a shaft, <laughs> I said shaft. Here, let's do the tool thing again. Come over here, shit tool. Let's see if you work. Ah, again, that's bizarro. I guess you can only use tools to make a torch. Which, again, I don't know how beneficial that would be. I, I kind of want to test that now, since I can. Holy storm, come down! I got enough fuel to do that. Let's get some sticks. Let's, oh, I forgot. I almost need some cloth. I think I just need one more, right? Yeah. Alright, let's go to a bench. I didn't have a bench last time, so... What's it doing? There we go. No, it shouldn't have... Did I have a bench last time? Alright, so let's see. Let's see, without a bench. I don't know why I came into this room. I always have to move around. Okay, so let's see if we can crafting. Ah, uh, you see? It gives me this option. I'm gonna use simple tools and see what happens. Now this torch, the funny thing is that I don't think the torch is any different. And I don't think that changed the time or how long it took to make it. Torches are exactly the same. There's no difference between them at all. Yeah, I don't I don't get the whole simple tools thing. I don't get it at all, or the use of tools. The tools are still at 100%. They were not used at all. Usable for basic crafting and repair. Hmm. I, I'm, I'm getting that there might be a use for these things, but what the, what it is, you see, you can turn it to shit. That's, you can always harvest it. Role-playing reasons? I don't fucking know. But that's what I'm here for, to just show you all the neat shit that, you know, that the Long Dark has to offer. And my need to have things sitting in a certain kind of neat, neat pattern, unlike the rest of my life. <laughs> like the rest of my life. Let's just craft them. They'll take 30 minutes. Uh, I don't even know what to use. We'll use. It doesn't even change the time. Cabin fever! See, I knew that was gonna happen. It just can't be helped. I wasn't even here that long. I should have just stayed in the. I couldn't have stayed in the car even if I wanted to. So, yeah, it jumped up quick. It jumped up very quickly because I have not relieved it enough. But it is. There's a fucking storm outside, so. You guys stop messing around. Even if it goes up, which it will. Oh, you know what's funny? My arrow abilities did not go up just by crafting that. Which I thought they did. Maybe they just they do when you make an arrow, maybe. Hmm. 
Yeah, well, this fucking storm doesn't seem to want to end. Well, hello. So, it has, it does seem to have calmed down a slight amount. Hello, arrows. I, I need to, I, I need to figure out where I'm putting shit. There we go. Let's put it in there. Just keep going here. This is where I keep raw materials, not finished materials. God knows I don't need that many torches, so I can put one of those away. Or two of them. You know, I'm gonna keep, I'm gonna put one away. That's right. It's windy as fuck out there anyways. Yeah, keep two. Drop one. Hello, sir. Uh, you're gonna go right here. There you go. But if I if I if I <laughs> if I keep on stuttering, mm, it's looking. Eh, it's not. It could be worse. I got plenty. I got plenty. I got enough to get by. The thought is here is you know fuck cabin fever. I mean I got it, so I just have to deal with it. I'm not too concerned. It's not the worst ever. It's better to deal with in more in pre mill conditions, but I tend to sleep too late. My character tends to sleep too late. Where I'm heading to could be could be dangerous. That's right, I have no weapons. Because there seemed to be just a just an amalgam of shit sometimes in that little area. Let's see there are two wolves and one bear. Or one bear, which is bad enough within itself. Oh, okay. Let's uh, before I do anything. Yeah, it's still windy as fuck out there. So, I mean, the, the blizzard seems to be done, but uh, the kick your ass kind of uh, bullshit is not. Uh, you know, I love pork and beans. And I want to leave him for that, but I'm taking these guys. This is just in case I get trapped in the car. That's uh, why I'm taking this stuff. In case I go out there and this is just wolves, which there are gonna be some wolves. I'd like to there. I like there to be less wolves, just enough so I can get by and move on because I have enough time to make it. I have most of the day to make it, and I can always just stay over there. Not that it's gonna help my cabin fever none, but that is neither here nor there. Oh, all right, so we're gonna figure this out here in a moment, but we're gonna do it on the next show. Thanks for watching. It's just gotta be brave. <laughs> Oh. <laughs>